Hey, what's up, guys? So when I said I'd be doing more videos with face cam, but I just had too much trouble trying to set it up, and I need to get a recording out for today. So we're just going to be playing some Modern Warfare. I've actually been playing a ton of uh, whatever this is, flotation oxidation. It's basically just rust and shipment 24-7, 5v5. It's really, really chaotic. And honestly, I love it. So uh, I actually haven't played Modern Warfare on video since uh, since it came out, basically. I got Gold Neog fully maxed out. Uh, I'm working on the MP7 and the MP5 right now. I'm 54 of my uh, MP7. I have a few more challenges to do. Hard point? Hey, at least it is an HQ. Yeah, this is definitely going to take me a long time to get used to playing and talking at the same time. It's not something natural. Kind of hard to get used to, but I'll get there. I was originally using the MP5, but Code Red kind of put me onto the MP7. I, I've been liking it. It's been one of my favorite weapons besides the MP or besides the AUG, and honestly, it's been really, really dope. I don't think the challenges should be the same for every weapon. You know, it's like get hit, fire kills, get crouch kills, uh, kill shortly after reloading. I mean, that's all well and good, right? Most of those you'll get on your own, but there are three challenges that you're probably gonna have to go out of your way to get, which is hit, fire kills, mounted kills, and crouch kills. Like who? Nobody plays like that, or like naturally, you know. But see what I mean? Like after doing the hip fire kill challenge for, for the AUG, it really kind of changed the way I play. Like if someone's up close, I'll hip fire now. Whereas before, I would always ADS. Like no matter what range they were at. So I guess these challenges do actually help you out for the better sometimes. But I don't know. They seem a little bit out of range sometimes. Now, if they had a challenge that was get a hundred assists, then yeah. 100 assists in one game, no problem, no biggie. Or get assists where you do 90% of the damage, but it's still an assist. Yeah, those challenges, I would do amazing on. Another thing I'm not a super big fan of is the fact that long shot kills have to be literally cross map. Have you guys seen those Instagram, like the, the Instagram bots? I remember back a few years ago when there were no bots at all. I mean, look at this. This is just absolutely ridiculous. I had to take a long screenshot just to capture all the bots in the comment section. Dude, I love shipment so much, especially domination on this map. It's actually hectic. It's crazy. See there, like I, I hit fire kill. It's something I never would have done, but I just did it subconsciously. Like you're not even thinking about it. I guess when you have to get what, like, what was it, 50, 75 hit fire kills? I had to get mounted kills in this map, dude. It was ridiculous, and and I had to do it on this map because it was just there were so many. The time before you would die and then see somebody again was so short that I had to do it because it was like 75 mounted kills and that was just ridiculous the veto i wish i could come out no no mm -mm, no 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 hey shipment is is chaotic but i've never experienced anything like that one uh clip with sensor in it one where he literally just spawned die spawned die spawned die literally it's basically just the definition of rust under the description of uh the rust map it should just be spawn die it's literally oh I don't have stems in this class. Oh, uh, oh, uh, this, this crate, either this crate, the yellow crate over on that spawn or the crate behind me. That's the move. That's the move. Yeah. This crate, this crate is the move. If you want to camp, I'm not a real big camper. Like, honestly, it's not even like interesting to camp to me because I need like action or something. I'm just waiting around, just waiting for somebody to come up to, to come up. But it's like, it makes it a lot. If I'm trying to, if I'm trying to get a challenge, uh, then yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll camp maybe Also another thing I really enjoy about this game is the store the store I feel like it's a lot better set up than the Fortnite store, but you know, that's what I love about this map It's just the the, the maps I hate are the ones that are super big This one is 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 super small, but like the just right ones that like uh, well, the, the train track one I don't even know the names of them, but I just picked up someone's shotgun. It is literally so chaotic I can barely I can barely hear anything. This is why in my opinion. This is the best map on this on this game But uh, what are we talking about Instagram the bots? Yeah, the bots are ridiculous It was a post about someone dying and they were like they were just out of pocket completely I used to report them, but now I just don't I don't I don't really like care to anymore you know, honestly, the whatever this is, the disruption UAV is kind of stupid because I already know what everything does. Trophy system, trophy system. Get out of here! Oh! Uh! Oh! Uh! How does he know? Dude, what, is, what even is the point of a Christmas soul on this map? Like, you can literally hit, like, one person max. It's kind of crazy to me that people still self-promote in 2020. Like, if anything, self-promoting is going to make me not want to check your stuff out. 
if I don't find it naturally, I'm not I'm not checking it out. Only problem about this map is that people it doesn't happen every game, but people will camp up here. I mean, it's a pretty good idea. People don't usually I mean, when you look up here, it's hard to find someone, but it's still kind of scummy. Only thing about the MP7, it's a little bit less long range than the MP5, but uh I don't mind it. I don't mind it. It, it just it feels like a good part of me using a gun is if it feels good, you know. I'm not going to use the PKM because it doesn't feel good to get kills on it. But the MP7, on the other hand, sometimes I feel like my teammates are working against me. Also, guys, let me know if my gameplay looks really jittery or stuttery because a lot of people have told me that. I guess it's because of the mouse that I'm on. It's like a $10 mouse from Amazon from five years ago. I know I really should get a new mouse, but it's like, hey, if it isn't broke, don't fix it. Well, rip. That's gonna be the end of this video. Again, gotta practice trying to play and talk at the same time because it's actually surprisingly hard. It's something you wouldn't think because you know you're just talking to your friends, but you're actually you have to talk to YouTube. It's something you wouldn't think about often, but yeah, gonna get better with time. I'll see you guys later. Peace.